Hello, this is H.G. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Xenogears. We're at... Well, it sounds like Shivat, but this is actually called the Snowfield Hideout. You could rest up here if you wanted to, or save, but... Oh, I already did that. Oh, they got... They still got cows around here. I, get, I guess that's what that thing is. Not really sure, but... Okay, well, let's take a look around. Well, it looks like... It kind of looks like Shiva. Oh. Well, there's not that many of us left, I would imagine. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, well... Yeah, part of Shiva... Or, well, all of Shiva crashed down to the Earth. At some point, I... I don't know when exactly, they don't... I don't think they ever say precisely what happened in-game. I, I assumed it was, like, shot down by Merkava or something or other, but... They don't really mention that directly, though. That kind of seems important. I mean, they went out of their way to mention that, like, Oh yeah, half of Bledovic was destroyed. But... Yeah, she bought up. Uh, yeah, don't worry about it. You'll just see what happens after that. Or whatever. Oh. Well, we can. I don't know about you. Hey, how's it going? Oh, you actually got a, a shop here. Okay. Is there anything I really care to buy? I don't think so. No, not really. Well, we can buy large ether stones, finally. Not that that really does us any good at this point. Ethers are basically going the way of the dinosaur. Oh. Did... Did I go to the wrong way? Oh, okay. Yeah, we're... Well, we got world map stuff that we could do at this time with the Yggdrasil 3, but no. Nah, let's, uh... Stick at the Snowfield Hideout. There's quite a few things that we can do there. Seems kind of odd that that one door specifically goes out there, but okay. Hey, how's it going? Oh? Well, are you just trying to dig a hole or something? Oh, uh, okay. Uh, never mind. I'm not really sure what the point of that was, but okay. How's it going? Oh. Are those those things from The Last Jedi? Oh. Sure, why not? 20,000?! Dude! What do you think I'm made of money? What are you even gonna do with the the money anyway. There's no society anymore, pretty much. Well, I guess we're all here, but... <laughs> Thanks for scaring them away! I, I, I didn't see that! Hey! You scared them away! Jerk. But no, actually, there is a good reason to do that, because if you do buy them, we can actually use this little elevator here. Somehow, the electricity is still working around here. I don't know how that works, but... Okay. Well, let's see. This is the Choo Choo's Lounge in Shiva. It's amazingly well-preserved after the crash landing. So, yeah, I don't think they ever mention, like, exactly when Shiva crashed. We just, well, we're just here after the fact. And, uh, yeah, at some point in time, it crashed. But we do get some, uh, pretty good stuff while we're here. Including the Speed Shoes, one of the best accessories in the game. It's basically auto-haste. It is obscene for the last... 5% of the game that we have left. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Well, 5, 10%, whatever. Something like that. Uh, yeah. 
<laughs> Please don't haunt me. No! But we do get a Hercules ring. That's pretty good, actually. That one... Oh, the hero costume is also pretty good for armor. But yeah, the Hercules ring... Uh, what is it? That increases your experience gains. And that'll be pretty good for Faye, because I would like to learn some more of his death blows. I need to... Uh, which one? I need to get him up to level 70 and 80 to learn his last two death blows, respectively. What level are we at, anyway? Okay, well, I should be able to get the first of the last two, but level 80, I'm probably not going to get there by the end of the game. So, in order to show off that death blow, I will have to actually grind, but I won't do that, like, during the main storyline. I'll just do that for, like, a bonus episode or something. Yeah, so that's where they put all those badges that we found, or we acquired earlier. Um... I think all the choo-choos are dead now. Except ours, of course. I mean, you can still use her. But, like, all the choo-choos that were here? Uh, yeah, I think they're all dead. Nuts. Well, yeah, I mean, Faye was talking about, like, all that grave robbing or whatever's going on. But, alright. So, I will put some of that stuff to use eventually, that equipment that we just got. Let's see. Oh. Hmm, that didn't land where it was before. Hmm. Okay, how's it going? Well, it's nice you actually still got some stuff working around here. Whoa, that is a huge gear. Okay, I do actually want to get some upgrades for our gears. Oh, yeah, we got, like, our anima, or omni gears up and running with like those nano machines that uh, Melchior was talking about last time, I think. But let's see. There's only a couple upgrades that I want to get here. Let's see. So I'm only going to buy upgrades for my main gears at this point, or my final party's worth of gears. Uh, let's see. I don't want to buy that stuff. Let me see. Okay, yeah. I do want to get this one for Crescents there. And let's see. Fenrir! Okay, let's see. Yeah, it still uses the same prefix that Heimdall used, but it's the same thing. Those are the best frames in the game for those two gears, but I'm not going to uh, buy anything else because there's another shop that we can go to that will have even better stuff. So let's uh, hold off on the rest for now. In order to buy everything that I want to get uh, for the remainder of this two, I need, I think it was 897,000 gold. So, well, fortunately I budgeted already in advance. But if you didn't, I will point out a place where you can do some money farming. And it'll be totally worth it to trivialize whatever remains in the game. Okay, let's see here. Now, if you recall, after defeating the elements... Let's see, we got that Kishin sword there. Can I just remove both of them? No, I can't. Okay. But uh, I want to remove that there so it'll actually be in my inventory for something we can do over here. At least I think it's here. Maybe it's... Yeah, it's here. It's here. Whoa! Man, all this stuff survived so well? Wow. Okay, well, let's see. I think there's only just the one guy here. Well, yeah. Most of humanity's dead. Or part of Deus. At least I assume most of humanity's dead at this point. I don't know if they ever give us any real hard numbers on that, but it sounds pretty grim. So yeah, like he was saying, with the Kishin Sword, uh, yeah, you can't have it equipped in order for the guy to take a look at it. What, are you taking a jackhammer to the thing? Oh. What is... What does that even mean? 
I thought it was swords to plowshares. No, no, that's another game. But, yeah, if you give it to him, you get the ultimate weapon in the game for Fenrir there. So that's pretty nice. And if you don't have another weapon to equip to remove it, well, I guess it's not the end. Well, it might be the end of the world, but... Well, you know what I mean. It's good to have it. And, yeah, we're going to be using Fenrir and Crescens in my final group. I only have Bart in the party because he was there by default at this point. And we'll have to go back to uh, the Exil in order to change things around eventually. But, all right, let's get to the main hub of this place. There's quite a few things we can do around here. Oh, for a second there, I thought that was a different elevator. And for a second there, I thought it was going to automatically take me up there when I didn't press the X button, even. Hey, how's it going? I wonder if Dan survived. Hmm. You know, now that I think about it, as far as when Shivat was shut down, or shot down, or whatever... But yeah, I mean, okay, so the last time we saw Shiva was when Dan was peeking in on Faye or Id or whatever before he took off. So yeah, I guess Shiva would have had to have been shot down by Merkava when we were doing all that stuff, but they just didn't really mention it or even show it or anything. Hmm. But all right. Hey, okay, how's it going? Oh, well, yeah, her en entire kingdom was shot down. So, can we... Oh, we can go here, okay. Yeah, I thought there was something around here. I totally missed this area the first time I uh, played the game. Or the, even the second time. It took me a couple times to actually find this little part here. And, yeah, there's the queen. Well, at least we still got snow. That is... snow. Right? It's not... something else, I guess? Reminded of near. Nothing, evidently. You've just been kind of sitting on your ass. What person? Oh, Ramses, you mean. Oh, what? Well, good for him, I guess? Ah, there we go. Yeah, now that you're no longer in power, now's the time for us to band together! Bipartisan support! Well, okay, there's more than one political... Well, power. Yeah, political power in the world. Or at least... At that point in time. Now, I don't know. Trying to knock some sense into the guy. What about who? Oh! They're standing right behind me, aren't they? Yes! I, I don't know. Can't think of anything witty to say. Not that I ever do. But if I could, I didn't. All of them? At the same time?
Well, I would beg to differ. We've kind of kicked his ass on several occasions. Booty! And we'll never see them again. No, seriously, I, I don't I don't think we ever do see them again. It's just like, oh yeah, we rescued him and he's okay now and Yeah, that's kinda it. They don't really do anything with him. But I guess it's better than nothing. By the way, the remainder of disc two, what little is left, is... What is it? Yeah, it's basically more like disc one at this point. No more chairs or spotlights or whatever. What do you mean by Zohar's spell? I wonder if that's a translation thing, because Ellie is not put under a spell. She was kind of taken over. Or possessed, or whatever you want to call it. What do you think this is? Lunar? No, not really. I kind of don't want to die. Again. Well, eventually that will be true. Good for you. Okay, Deus is buying. That makes more sense than Zohar's spell. Zohar isn't even a... Well, I guess it's kind of a conscious being, but... Well, you know what I mean. But, okay. I do like that they, we get a little bit of closure for Ramses. Just not really... A whole lot. Would have been kind of cool if they did kind of a Legend of Dragoon thing. But I won't spoil for those who haven't played the game. You know, I just had a thought. Where's Big Joe around here? He's got to be around. He's got to be in one of these places. One of these rooms. Well, at least you got a nice little snow hill. Uh, good for you guys, I guess. Kind of looks like Jesse. I don't think that's him. Oh, yeah, you might have noticed from the world map, a lot of things have changed. But we'll get to that soon enough. Hey, hey you're still alive. What do you mean? Not anymore. Well, there's... It's kind of late for that at this point. Besides, the monster's gone. or It's been integrated or whatever. How's it going? What do you mean? Where's your mom, anyway? Oh, yeah! If you recall, like, way at the beginning of the game, there was a, a ring we found in the garden there. Okay, I guess her mom is alive somewhere. 
But yeah, if you found that ring way at the beginning of the game, and you give it to her... Aww. Well, I think something happens if you give her the ring. Ah, there we go. Hey, all right, another one of those things. Is that like two of them now, or what? Hmm. Okay, I guess Yui isn't uh, around here. Yeah, let me check my inventory there. Let's see, yeah, we did get two of those things. I wonder if they stack with each other. I never thought about that. Like, if you equip two of them on the same character. I don't know. I'd have to look that up. For some reason, I totally forgot that we actually get two of them. It never occurred to me in my test runs that that might be possible. I don't know. I mean, you could equip two of them. I just don't know if it would actually do anything. Oh. Well, we kind of need fire to live. Yeah, didn't they say, like, during the Diabolos invasion or whatever that was, it was, what was it, like, 90, 95% of the population was destroyed? Oh, nuts. Well, why don't you just go to the Fanatics Tower, dude? No, that's another game. I don't know that there's much green left, but okay. Oh, no, oh, they got a bunch of... Are they cats? Some kind of animals around here. What do you mean? Oh, okay, yeah, they are cats. <laughs> uh, yeah, that is true. So can I talk to the last dude there? <laughs> the cats are trying to trap me in the room! They want attention. What are you talking about? Oh. Yeah, I know the feeling, like... My office, where I do my recording. All the computers, it gets a little hot. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll do the best I can. Um, uh, well, I guess they haven't gotten here, huh? Oh, well, good for you guys. Well, fighting's one way to help people. So what are you guys doing here? Discussing military strategy or something? Yggdrasil 10? If only.
What are you kids doing anyway? Hey, get back here! Ha uh ha. -huh. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's see, there's... I think there's just one more... Or, yeah, pretty much. Well, yeah, there's a couple more parts to this place. And then we'll actually get on with doing some stuff in the world now that we can actually access it! Let's go. Oh. Is that where it went? It's not that big. I'm guessing that's where it went to get out of here or something. Well, this place seems to be holding up okay. Ha ha. What do you mean, little brother? Ah. Uh, I'm guessing he's talking about Dan. Not that we're actually related or anything. I guess he means, like, figuratively or something. Because I was such close friends with his sister. Hmm. Have I heard someone like that before? Oh! Yeah, that's another item we got way at the beginning of the game, huh? Oh! Yeah, eventually! We haven't really planned that far ahead yet! So let's see, I think that's seven of the wings of the Snowfield hideout. Just one more, then. And still some more treasures we can get around here. Oh, well. Top. Oh. <laughs> Maybe days to get frozen. Yeah, pretty much. Oh. Well, you gotta drink something. Oh. <laughs> We're all gonna die! So, you have electricity, but you don't have heating? Um, yeah, pretty much. Oh, hey, this was, uh, one of those other little rooms. Hmm? Oh, what, what's that? It's a clone! Or a mirror? Are you... I'm not controlling this, viewers. This is kind of... Doing automatically. Yeah. Not really sure what the point of that was, but okay. There's... I don't think there's anything else in that room. But there is stuff over here, if I can get to it. Hmm? Who is that? Oh, hey! Dolphin people! Hey! Ah, um, that's the Thames got deleted from disc two. I, I mean, uh, tank. Well, it's women and children first, and the captain kind of has to go down with the ship. Oh, 
Well, what do you mean? Couldn't do anything about the angels. What do you mean? Hmm. Oh, yeah. I think we uh, beat her earlier, but uh, no, I don't want to. You can play a game of speed in order to win a couple other items. or like some dolls that are accessories for Choo Choo there. But, yeah, I'm not using Choo Choo, so I don't really care about that. And it is really, really hard to win those games. Yeah, that was fast. But then again, I guess you are demi-humans. Well, I don't know what that has to do with anything, but maybe it's different. Nuts. Well, yeah, you want to see other people doing well, I guess. Nothing wrong with that. Well. Oh, I guess that was the kid that was running out of here, huh? So I guess the other kid is, uh, not his either. Okay, that would explain. Well, it's not really a stairway, but... Is that like an apparition, or a ghost, or what? Um, maybe wishful thinking, though. Hmm? Oh! Is that really him? Hey! You embarrassing fool! I like how they have the Thames theme music here. Just one last time. I think it's the last time. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, really? We actually can go over there. It's not marked on the map, but yeah, you can go there. Hmm, I'll remember that for later. Years. Because as we all know in JRPGs, when the world is in imminent peril, it's side quest time! Um, yeah, I suppose that would be something to do. So, where are you going, dude? Oh, uh, okay. Well, good to have you around, I guess. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's see. Yeah, you just kind of jump behind the bar there in order to... What is it? No, wait, I don't want to go there. That's where we started there. I want to get outside. 
But yeah, like I was saying, uh, the world map has changed somehow. I don't know what, uh, how exactly, but yeah, there's quite a few new places. There's like the continent to the far northwest of the world map. There's where we are now. There's a continent on the east side of the world. I don't know if they ever explain how that happened. Uh, someone was saying in the comments, H.C. Bailey, the, the reason those places weren't visible on the world map on disc one was because, like, there were some gates, like, they had around Solaris to keep them from being visible or something or other. I don't know. I don't know, maybe there's something in the perfect worst, but I've never read any of that, so I wouldn't know about it, but that's one thing to do. But yeah, there's quite a few places that we could go to, or we could go fight Deus. Guess which I'm gonna do first! Find out next time on Let's Play Xenogears! This is H.G. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day!